a lot of fun. Hmm? Yeah, it's um, obviously we had a pretty big summer. Or, have you want to say it? Like it was good having doing a lot of big shows. Not not many bands get to do ten big shows. Might get one for an album launch, but we were fortunate enough to be able to do a few big local shows and then some big shows interstate and then like a couple of festivals that we got to do. So it's a lot of fun. Um, we enjoy it. Take it reasonably lightly. Don't take ourselves too seriously. Having a really, really, really fun time doing it. We started, uh, started out only doing a couple songs that uh, I think we were doing having keys on, and um, just kind of yeah played those two, and then I think it, I think it opened up some ideas for uh, as they were writing the songs, having keys and, and more parts in mind, and, um, kind of gave more options. These keys are all of them now. Cool. Um, have a great time. <laughs> I've all got our annoying little video synopsis and patterns. 20 minutes. I'm coming back in here. Declan's inappropriate behaviour at most of the time. Hannah <laughs> gets irrational very quickly. <laughs> Nothing, sometimes. <laughs> That's why we love her. Of course, yeah. Seth drinks way too much. Way too much. Seth, is just Seth drinks a lot. <laughs> no, not really. Have a couple of drinks is so always really nice to do just to relax before I get <laughs> Carl likes to do a seance before every gig. Really? But I swear, he's, he moves his hand like it's not. I don't believe in that stuff. I, I think there's someone moving it. Uh, <laughs> that's the only one I can think of. Hannah's a vegan. I think that's the best thing about playing with any of the bands that I play with is, um, is just the friendships that you make and getting to know. I've had a really good time getting to know everyone's family and, um, and other friends that I never would have got to meet. We do before we're going to play a big show. We practice the set that we're going to play, and we like play it exactly how we're going to play it. If we're going to do something different, we plan to do something different, which is good. But yeah, everything is really over rehearsed I think in a good way. Making sure that exactly how you want it to sound, that everything's gonna sound how you want it to sound. Same with sound check before you do it. I don't have a problem having the sound check being the whole set. It's good. Uh, well I like to it's always good when you have uh, gigs where there's you know a, a room where you can put all your stuff or you can hang out in beforehand and um, I like to just sit down and maybe uh, have a bit of a warm up. Good sound checks, nice. You just have a drink of beer or coffee or what I feel like, and usually chill out with the guys. When it's like a show in the Hobart, just chill out with the guys back up in North Hobart at Nico and Bert's house and mm -hmm. play a bit of FIFA on the PlayStation. And <laughs> just chill out, really. Yeah. We don't have any psych up rituals or any kind of. I think we're all naturally pretty relaxed people, so we just had to keep it pretty just a little key and then we'd get up and do our thing.